Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm unboxing a new basic doll from Integrity Toys. She was unveiled to the club members last month with three other basic girls. Natalia Fatale, Amira Majid and Poppy Parker. The basic dolls tend to have a lower price point and a much larger edition size, which sometimes includes restocking, that make them more accessible to the general public. The one I chose is Erin Salston, titled Night Out and she's designed by Jesse Isla for the New Face line. Even though I'm not a huge fan of her outfit, I couldn't pass up Erin, who we haven't seen in a while, and especially at the W Club price of $110. She's basic, but she's Erin. This doll is a limited edition of 5,000 pieces worldwide. Okay, let's take a look at the packaging. You can see the holographic New Face logo on the exclusive lightweight packaging made especially for this basic edition series. Now let's see what's inside. Here she is. She's beautiful. The difference in tone between her head and body is very noticeable once in hand and I don't like it. I'm not the only one if I refer to the many comments from the other connectors. She has the Erin 2.0 head sculpt. Her skin tone is FR white and her hair color is titled Mahogany. She's really gorgeous. The screening is so good with her side glance blue eyes and the neutral makeup palette. Her body type is New Face 3.0 with high heeled foot sculpt. Here's the certificate of authenticity. It's a very big addition. We have the white version of the New Face acrylic stand. The pole of the stand. As she is a basic doll, she really doesn't have many accessories. But there is a bonus accessory pack that is actually completing this new face doll. I didn't buy it, but I'll show you the promo pictures right after. She comes with high-heeled shoes, described as slingback dark smoke clear vinyl pumps, with statement heels. I just love them. and simple faux diamond stud earrings, that's all. Here is the accessory pack called Bow Teak Details, designed to complete the Erin doll, and it costs $65. The only accessories I would love to have with the doll are the bag and the bow shaved hair brooch. Okay, let's take her out of the box. I really like her makeup. The colors are lovely. But the only issue is the yellowish tone of her head. And her face is a bit shiny too. It's really annoying. I hope Integrity Toys will solve this in the next future editions. Her micro sequent cocktail mini dress is nice but not more than that. The white satin shoulder draping is non-removable. She has long manicured nails matching her lipstick. And her toenails too. Now let's take off her hairnet. I love the mahogany color of her hair, but this hairstyle I'm not sure. Since I saw the promo pictures, I knew that I had to change her hair. Something fresher, more current, and less dated. I will show you her new hairstyle later in the video. The hairline looks fine. Yes, I have to remove all this. I'm not saying it's bad hairstyle. And it looks pretty good on her, but it's not my cup of tea. 
Here she is on the stand, totally dressed with her accessories. This dress is recreating the one worn by Mademoiselle Lilith Blair. Now it's time to undo their hairstyle. She's not fully rooted, but it's okay because I'm going to give her a high ponytail. I washed her hair with shampoo. They look very long. Here she is with her new hairstyle and a different look. Okay, it's not perfect, but the idea is here. I hesitated for a long time, but I finally decided to cut her hair of 5 centimeters and to curve the hair inward. She looks so beautiful now. What do you think of this new hairstyle? Was I right to cut her hair? Tell me in the comments what you think of her. I really hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing of Erin Salston, Night Out. Thank you very much for watching. Like, comment, share and subscribe. Stay safe. See you very soon for the next unboxing video. Bye for now.